So the Apple AirPods Pro 2 release date. When is it? Are they coming out with the AirPods 3 coming in April? And what are the price details? Well, let me share everything along about the design and features for both the Pro 2 and the AirPods 3. So at the end of 2020, we got the AirPods Max, but what about the normal AirPods series and the Pro series? What is their release date and price and the design and specs? Well, today I want to talk about everything we know for these two new models. But just quickly, let me know in the comments below as you're watching this video if you own a pair of AirPods or what ones you're planning to buy in the future. So let's begin then with the AirPods Pro 2 and its release date. The most recent AirPods Pro 2 release date leak suggests we won't have to wait long, as previous reports had said. A leak from DigiTimes has pointed towards a launch in the first half of 2021. In fact, they point towards an April release time. If this leak is correct, we believe the release date will be near the end of April like the 23rd, as Apple in the past have introduced other products near this time, like the last iPhone SE came out on October 24th in 2020. However, John Prosser's old post from October in 2020 stated we would not see the AirPods Pro 2 until the end of 2021 or even into early 2022. To go with that, Minji Kuo has also claimed that the AirPods Pro 2 will go into production from Q4 2021 to Q1 2022, as reported by Mac Rumors. But again, this leak was in July 2020. I've even got to admit though that the AirPods Pro 2 have also been notably absent from rumours around a possible Apple April event until this leak came from DigiTimes. This event was initially tipped to happen in March time and it was supposed to launch the AirPods 3, the iPad Pro 2021 model and also the Apple AirTags, but the same sources later said that this event would now take place in April. In fact, if you want more info about these products and others like the new M1X iMac and the MacBook Pros, then check out my other videos on this channel and make sure to hit the subscribe and the notification bell to get the latest details. For price though, the original AirPods Pro is currently sold at $249, US which at the time of launch made these wireless earbuds the most expensive in this category. If anything, Apple may feel compelled to raise it by about $25 to $50 US if major upgrades are implemented. But there again, John Prosser did say in his leak that the price would stick at $249. For design, according to Ming-Chi Kuo, the AirPods Pro 2 will look the same with the internal set to be updated. But a report from Bluemug suggests that the AirPods Pro could get an all new design that drops the stems on the actual Pros. Bloomberg sources suggest that a current prototype design looks more like the Samsung Galaxy Buds Live. I'm still really hopeful that Apple could make some improvements on the design that exists at the moment. One main complaint is the fiddly nature of those stems of the pods, which is not the most responsive, so improvements would be welcome on this. On top, Apple's reluctance to offer the earbuds in anything other than the glossy white means they get quite grubby and they attract dirt easily. We're hopeful for some more new colours like black in the renders that you're seeing here. So for features, we're expecting active noise cancellation, transparency mode, IPX4 resistance and QI wireless charging on the case again. There's still improvements though for the battery for example. At 4.4 hours with ANC on, battery life is not the best. Battery life of say 7-8 to eight hours per charge would be more in tune with the wireless earbuds are heading towards now. Hopefully Apple will make the necessary improvements here. Moving now on to the AirPods 3 news now, let's start with its release date. We can't deny that the pandemic has moved things around for a lot of tech company. In fact, Apple's schedule has moved a fair bit over the last year. At one point, the AirPods 3 was listed for a 2020 release date, but that didn't obviously happen. Now it looks like 2021 is the target date for the new AirPods 3. Originally, John Prosser hinted at an Apple event in March, and this included the new iPad Pro, AirTags, Apple TV, and a new AirPods model. 
However, Prozza later tweeted that the Apple event will take place in April time. As mentioned earlier, we believe the release date of the April Apple products will be more like April the 23rd, as Apple in the past have introduced other products near this time, like the iPhone SE last year on April 24th. Again, if you want more news about those other products and to get the latest news on them and others, do check out my other videos on my channel and make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. For price then, a leak from a Chinese site called the Elec, the leak claims that the AirPods 3 will be 20% cheaper than the AirPods Pro, putting it at 199 US dollars. To be honest, that's not as exciting as it sounds. That's actually quite the high cut from the 159 US dollars for the AirPods Pro. Two, which might disappoint anyone hoping that the direct follow-up would share a similar price tag or less to them. However, there are going to be a lot of new features and a whole new design. So for that design of the new AirPods, there have been quite a few leaks that have surfaced. The images were posted on Twitter by Leaks Apple Pro and show off what looks like a pair of AirPods with shorter stems, backing up previous rumours that the next AirPods would take some style cues of the noise cancelling AirPods Pro. Not only that, but renders of the new AirPods were posted by Gizmo China with the site claiming that the images came from the suppliers of the rumoured earbuds. These renders look very similar to the photos posted by Leaks Apple Pro as well as previous images by 52 Audio in late February time. With features though for the new AirPods, Minchi Kuo, Kuo has made a number of correct Apple predictions in the past and says that the new AirPods 3 will adopt a compact system in package, an SIP, a solution similar to the AirPods Pro. To chuck the tech jargon out of the window, what this allows is for product makers to create smaller devices and its technique has been used already in the creation of AirPods Pro. Another feature that is deemed likely is spatial audio. Apple Spatial Audio is the company's answer to Dolby Atmos for headphones and it's already been implemented into the AirPods Pro and the AirPods Max on their over-ear headphones. It takes 5.1, 7.1 and Dolby Atmos content and applies directional audio filters placing sound in a 3D sphere. What's unique to spatial audio though is that it uses the built-in accelerometers and gyroscopes inside the earbuds and headphones to track the positions of your head as well as the position of your iPhone or your iPad or your Apple Watch, whatever you're connected to. That means when you watch films on your iPhone or iPad, the sound will always be placed directly based on the action that's happening on the screen. So if you turn your head or shift your device, it will still sound as though the sound is coming directly from where the screen is. Also, Apple is looking to improve the battery life of the AirPods, which currently comes in at a rather weak 4-5 to five hours. We certainly hope they do improve the battery life, however, Mention from 52 Audio has already said that the onboard 5-hour battery life provided in the buds won't be increased, with any improvements possible only being applied to actually the actual charging case. Well, really guys, that is everything we know on the AirPods today. So don't forget if you have liked this video to press the like button and of course to hear the latest Apple news, reviews and comparisons, please do press subscribe followed by that notification bell. Until next time, see ya!